All right, fine. We'll have to go around. Hey, heroes! Isaac Zephyr, and welcome back to Ocarina of Time. When last we left off, I got myself some magic beans, and we had some uh, some beans to plant. And then we're gonna go get some more rupees, and then get completely and totally gouged by the magic beans guy. Whoop! Where was the spot? It was over here, wasn't it? Behind the store. Looks like it was behind the store. Yes, and we've already done... Whoop. We already did the sculptural spot there. There was also one in Death Mountain that we did, and... Death Mountain here. Um, I want to say there was another one. Earl Castle? No. Huh. I know there's ten magic bean spots total. That's at least two. Hmm. Well, damn. I'm at a loss because I cannot remember where the other one was. Have we only done two? Oh, uh, Kakaruho Graveyard. Let's take our shortcut to Death Mountain. Hopefully the episode doesn't have any problems, just finished encoding something. I got the heart piece out of that, right? Alright. All right, let's go. I didn't play the Sun Song for them. I think the Sun Song is the only other song I have, right? Yeah, Sun Song, and then it's Song of Time and Song of Storms that I need to play for the frogs before I can get their heart piece. And I can't jump down, I have to walk. Hey Roly Poly Explodey Goron, how you doing today? Fine weather we're having, eh? And that would be stuff finished in Cody. Now I just gotta finish today's uploads, and hey, I can play some League of Legends. Speaking of, on League, I am the exact same username as I am here, so if you want to add me as a friend, feel free. Maybe we'll play a game. I need a stupid boomerang for you. He's a jerk. Fucking here. All right, and down here to the graveyard, Kakadoko Village. Hey, Keaton Mask Guy. All right, hop. Quickly hit up the graveyard. I can't imagine we're at 30 gold sculptures yet, so. Ah, uh, oh, I can catch the chickens again. Nah, nah. I'll just play the song, get one more magic bean after this. Is it here? No, it wasn't here. Yep, it was in in the graveyard. Eight. Eight. And bean. Cool. Alright, that marks all the places I've gotten Skeletalus, so if I find any new ones, bug, then bean. Uh, and put these back on because I'll probably need them. Whoop! Oh shit! Stupid C stick. Try to use it to change my camera angle. All right. Do do do. We're not horribly far from Zora's River, so it should be a quick stop in. 
I'm at that glorious part of the day where there's no music. It's kind of off-putting. How many skeletons do I have? 22? 22. Not too bad, not too bad. We're well on the way to all 100. Well on the way. I don't know if I've said it yet, but uh, back when I was a kid and this game first came out, so I would have been like seven, not even, there was like a kind of a rumor going around that if you got all of the Skulltulas, you got what was known as like the Skulltula Sword, and it was like better than Big Ron's Knife and all that. And I think it just was Big Ron's Knife in terms of like the, the cheat thing, because I always remember seeing an image of like the Gerudo, like the pit in Gerudo Valley, the the ravine, and like getting the last Skulltula right there, and then like opening a chest and getting it. I mean, I'm thinking back on it, it's like, oh, that, that was that was silly. I mean, there was clearly other things in the game. There's already Big Ron Sword. Why are you here? Are you going to, like, scold me for leaving? Come on. I get 60 rupees. Nope. Woohoo! Looks like you've gotten bigger. Just ahead lies Zoro's Dome. Seriously? You're gonna make me go through this shit again? Checking this water source. Door will not open. I can't even skip it. Uh, all right. All right, cool. Thanks for uh, thanks for reminding me about that. Maybe I like a game flag didn't go off. I don't know. All I know is pick you up. I'm not gonna buy beans immediately. We already did that. So, I am going to proceed to use this chicken. Whoop, out of my face. Whoop. I'm going to use this chicken to get as far as I can. Or as far as I need to, anyway. Let's see, I want to go. Whoop. All right, back we go. I'll get the rupees later. Whoop! Throw you up there. Actually, you know, I think I can get there without the chicken at that point. At this point, I want to. Where's the platform there? Can I get onto that? Uh, okay, I might need the chicken. What's this bit? A little gated area? For some reason? Hmm. Okay. Whoa! It's not fall. Chicken, up you go. Grab. Up you go, chicken. Grab. Alright. We can make this. Just gotta be very careful. Whoop! Alright, and... Touchdown. Get out of here. And up we go. Whoop. Hey, other chicken. Ooh, a hole. Well, let's blow up this rock first, because this chicken ain't going nowhere. Doot. Down we go. Oh, fairy fun. Not bad. I don't need anything, but... Grab. That sounded glitchy as hell. Alright. And you, chicken. Take me across! Oh, and I fell in the hole. <laughs> uh, rupees? Twenty of them. Sweet. All right, we can afford the next bean, but not right now. All right, chicken. Let's get the rest of the way to Zora's domain, and if I don't need you, I'll come back. And hop. Whoa! Come on, we can make it. Perfect. Touchdown. Whoa! avoid you. Thank you. Add him away. 
Oh, there is a gold sculpture. However, first things first, there's a heart piece here too. Right there. And for that, I need to go. Whoa! Completed another heart container. Uh oh. Had to get that kill quick because he would have disappeared in a second. Come on, up the ladder. Cool. We did it. And we can't go this way without the ability to dive from it, correct? And then we will have a shortcut. Yeah, no, we gotta do some stuff first. Alright. That's fine. That's fine. Alright. Quarter turn. We'll see how our rupee situation is doing after we go into Zora's domain for a bit. I mean, the frogs aren't going anywhere. Whoa! Zora's domain. Alright. Oh, shit. Alright, is there a way in here? Yes. Nope, bombs go out, so that is something else. I think it's Song of Storms, maybe? Hmm. Alright. Hello, you. Who are you? We are the Zoras, the proud aquatic people. So, you say you have some connection with Hyrule's royal family. Well, what do you want from us? Well, first things first, I want a stick. Because there's a lot of unlit torches around here. Now I gotta remember the path for this. If I recall, this is one of the harder ones. The game's even given me a stick. It's like, do it! Light the things! Get the treasure! Alright. So, I need to go... Whoa. King Zora, is that a beehive behind your head? I think that's a beehive up there. I never noticed that beehive before. Alright. Not that beehives do anything, so... Uh, oh, okay, let's go. Don't have a lot of time. Okay, that likes that permanently. And swap! Shite! I have screwed up. Shit. Uh, the camera angles here. A pain. Okay, go! Directly around. And... Light swing. And... Go! I don't think I'm allowed to roll here. Light swing and whoop. You gotta kinda like hug this wall. And then whoop. Ah, did I screw it up? Which one unlit? The one in front of the store? Yes, it was the one in front of the store. Got it. I was worried that middle one was going to go out while I was doing that. Alright. And... What glorious treasure awaits? It's a big box. It's... Sweet. Piece of heart. They litter it all over the place. Like trash. Alright. Whew. Now for the pain in the ass of this area. What? That wasn't the pain in the ass? I know, right? Did these pots come back? I just want to kill them. Hmm. Alright. Up we go. You know, it only like just dawned on me what I look like. Like it just randomly dawned on me. <laughs> Is that another beehive? I don't remember how to get rid of these things. I could have sworn you could have shoot, you could shoot them, but 
Ugh. Maybe I need the boomerang. All right. Yo, diving guy. Diving game, 20 rupees. Wanna play? Sure. Okay. Pick up all the rupees I throw from here. You have only a limited amount of time. When you pick them all up, come back here. I'll give you something very nice. Okay, looks like we got a little cluster. Start! Woo! Alright, gotta aim for them. Nope, I didn't get any off the hop. Okay. But we got a little cluster here. This is good. Whoa! And dive. Whoa! And dive. Whoa! And whoa! One more for good measure. Got something very nice for you. Come and get it. Alright. Let's go up this way. Whoa. I wonder if this like, registers the difference between day and night. Doesn't seem like it. I mean, I know there's a Skulltula in the Goron area that I missed. Then again, I think maybe I only went there during the day? What a graceful dive! Now please, take this. This is a scale of our kind. With this, you can dive much deeper under the water. Super scare. Jump in water, press A. You can dive deeper than you could before. Alright, that being said... Let's head, oh, shite, to Lake Hylia. New area. Whoop, I need you. Got an empty bottle. Put something inside, press C to use it. What? Something's already inside. All right. Let's get our Lake Hylia chores done. Hey, Scarecrows. How you doing? I am Bonoru, the Scarecrow musical genius. I hear a song once and never forget it, baby. All right. Whoa, you have an ocarina? Well, why don't you play a tune on me with it, baby? Well, not bad. I will remember it for you anyway. I don't mean I can remember only eight notes, but let's cut it right there for now, baby. There it is. And what's with you? My name is Pierre, the Wandering Scarecrow. Actually, I wish I could wander to look for soul-moving sounds, but I'm kind of stuck here. Don't worry, give it time. I, I got you, babe. Whoop. That is my favorite way to set up the Scarecrow song, though. If you recognize it, it's actually from Majora's Mask. Fun fact. Alright. We spent last episode playing a game. Let's go after Barracuda. Well, do you want to go fishing for 20 rupees? Sure. Oh no, you don't have a rumble pack. With a rumble pack, you can feel the vibrations of a fish on your hook. This time, no rumble for you. Okay, listen up. Walk up to the water's edge and press Z to look at a fish. While looking at a fish, you can cast your line with B. Press A to break the line. When the lure drops into the water, you can wiggle it with the control stick. If you're a novice, you can also use B. Reel in your lure with A, hold down A and R to reel it in faster. If you feel a hit, press A and down to set the hook. After that, reel it in with A. You understand? Yep, I understand. I'm so generous, I'll let you fish for as long as you want. However, you can keep only one fish. The biggest fish ever caught here weighed six pounds. After you cast, you can change your view with Z. Let's fish. Alright. Oh, jeez. It's been forever. The last time I was here was an Ocarina of Time 3D, so the graphics were a little bit better. That's not the fish I want. 
Where the hell does Barracuda stay? I'm pretty sure that's him, right? I'm just gonna wander here. I used to remember having to stand somewhere. All right, let me just get up here. I think that's him. All right, well, we got a fish. It's good practice. Here you go, the opposite direction of the fish. Two pounds. No, let's not keep it. Hmm. All right. I know where the fish. Ah, oh, shit! Did he leave? I think he left. Let's check. Ah, I don't see him. Shite. Wait. Okay, I think he's back. So let's cast there. Okay. Ah, crap. This isn't the good. This isn't the fish. This is not my barracuda. Come on, you. Yeah, get the hell over here. Like, I beached you. Well, well, it's about four pounds. Yeah, sure, I'll keep it for now. Just get him out of the way. Ugh. Stop targeting the shitty fish. Yeah, I know. Let me enjoy myself for a minute. I'm allowed to relax and fish. I mean, he can't get in without the other two spiritual stones. What's he gonna do? Alright, looks like he came back. Oh, get out of here, midgets. Alright. Whoa! Alright. Hopefully that lined up properly. Come on. Oh, you suck. Oh, you suck hard. All right. All right, come on. Okay. Come on, Barracuda. Whore. You whore! Let's try this again. Alright. Ah, son of a bitch. Ugh, he's gonna swim into the deep water now. Uh, tiny fish. Get the hell out of here. Four pounds. I already have a four pounder. Get the hell out of here. And zip. He's not coming back yet. Hmm. Maybe a different angle? Hmm. Also, you know what? That's kind of one thing I never really did, was get the sinking lure. I always managed without it. Sinking lure is prohibited. After all. Get, get. I don't want... I, whatever. Let's go out of fish. Okay, he's back. So, I need to aim for that old area again. Look like a big one. Alright. 
What happened? I lost it. Alright, fine. I lost it. That's fine. That fish will not bother me again. Alright. You're the one I want. Oh, fuck. Is that the right button? Okay, come on. Ugh. Erg. The relaxing aggravation that is fishing. Okay. There we go. Alright. Come on, you. Come on. Pull. Pull. Pull with him. With him. Keep pulling to the right. Keep pulling to the right. Come on. Come on. I've got him in the shallows. I've got him in the shallows. Yes! Yes! Real Lunker. Weighs a solid 10 pounds. Oh yeah. Screw your... Screw you four pound fish. Ha! Ha! Oh, satisfaction. Where's the exit? <laughs> I actually I did not expect to get him in this episode. <laughs> yeah, guess what, buddy? I caught a ten pound fish. What do you want? Weigh my fish. <laughs> Whoa! This fish is huge! Looks like a new record. Weighs at least ten pounds. Seriously. Alright, here's your prize. I'll come back in seven years and catch you again, Barracuda. Mark my words. Mark my words. I'm done fishing. See you in ten years, Barracuda. Alright. Where to now? I think... Well, let's head up the shore. I mean, we can't dive deep enough to get anything around here anyway, so... Actually, you know what? It might have been better to stay over there, because there may be a Skulltula. There might be a Skulltula over here. I should probably check before completely abandoning fishing. Pretty sure it's not open at night, so... I don't hear any shuck shuck shucking, so... Hey, bombs! Alright. Alright, stick near the wall for now. Just gonna roll up this way. I don't hear any shook shook shooks. I think I might need the boomerang for the one that's over here. But hey, bean spot! Bugs. Bean. We can get that in the morning, though, so let's do a quick search. Ah, damn it. Need boomerang. Need boomerang will travel. Soft mound. Yeah, and I can't get up yet, so. Alright. Boop! We got the Sculptula. Boop! Got him. And 
let's mark area five. Ah, that'll be helpful in seven years. All right, this area here, just that. Doesn't look like anything's down there. And since this is an area at night, I'm going to... Just because I want to check around near the owl at night. Hey there, bud. What are you doing? You've come a long way to get up here. You should look at the map subscreen sometimes. Isaac, this is a beautiful lake full of pure, clear water. At the lake bottom, there's a water temple used to worship the water spirits. The Zoras are guardians of this temple. Woohoo! The Zoras come from Zora's domain in northeast Hyrule, an aquatic race. They are longtime allies of Hyrule's royal family. I heard that only the royal family of Hyrule can enter Zora's domain. Woohoo! I'm on my way back to the castle. If you want to come with me, hold on to my talons. I don't! No! No! Don't take me to the castle! Don't want to go back to the. Can I like avoid him? Whoa. Okay. We're good. Oh. Just business grubs. Bombs don't need any. What's up? Deku seeds, don't need any. And, uh, what do you sell? Deku nuts. Alright. So, till next time, this will be Isaac Zephyr, signing out, and I will see you all. Oh, fuck! I jumped through his head. See you all later, heroes.